In April 1937, the BBC broadcast a radio talk by one of the leading writers of the 20th century. This is the only surviving record of the voice of Virginia Woolf. Words, English words, are full of echoes, memories, associations. And that is one of the chief difficulties in writing in the day. Fifty years later, another great writer was in the spotlight, quizzed about his new novel, The Satanic Verses. What's true about the book is that it does break a number of taboos, which, in my view, are very important to break. With the advent of broadcasting, scholars became national celebrities. I feared the possibility that the state was all too ready to start taking over our brains and turning us into good little citizens without the power of choice. Love is wise, hatred is foolish. I don't believe there's a feminist alive who wants to abolish femaleness. So what, what I really worry about is, is gratuitous optimism, not gratuitous violence. Borders, I think, are meant to be crossed. What is there in human nature that allows an individual to act without any restraints whatsoever? Have the time. We believe in the abolition of money. We believe in the appropriation of all private property. I think, you know, we're in, culturally, we're in the kind of phase of permanent revolution. How do you run a free society? You haven't been able to. 